green interwebs and grandchildren. First thing off, let's say goodbye to the trainer whip for now. I don't think it'll really be that great until we upgrade this class, which we can't really do until we get free digits. Which means that we'll actually be able to do it the next digit we get. So, with that out of the way, this has been. This is Jackie K, bringing you more Let's Play Golden Sun. Last time we made it out of the Yampei Desert, and while we could have headed towards Morgana, I decided to take you all through a little detour. Tour. Little, I mean, like, completely long and going in the complete opposite direction, but... Pardon that, I have an audience, and I thought they actually had something to say. Where was I? Yeah. We're gonna do stuff that's not related to plot. Which includes, but is not limited to, the gins and summons. Part of the reason I didn't just take care of this right when we could have gone to Motsaka. And that is not the Jin. Nor I don't think you can find one there. Which makes me wonder why I was wandering around the trees. I guess I'm just so unsure whether to go into that big, large plane or head down. I think I see a town up ahead, so we'll head down first. If it's the town I think it is, it'll be well. Oh, it's not the town I'm thinking of. Mm. Yeah, I think we want to wait to really go there. Now, where was that cave? I think I want to go there first and get the summon and maybe even the gen of Muxada out of the way. Dino, you're not even worth my time of cutting. So just die real quickly for the sake of everyone on the interwebs. Yeah, this is definitely not the most efficient way to go about, but it's definitely the way I want to go about. This looks like there would be a Dijin here, so I'm just gonna run around. Nope. Yeah, this is a very inefficient way to go about here. If we wanted to be efficient, we could go to that plane first, but I just want to get these the gins and summons that I'm thinking of out of the way while I'm still thinking of it. Uh, where are we on the grand old map piano? Um, wow, we actually travel pretty far pretty fast. And that's even without speeding things up. <sighs> Stupid dead end. And where, oh where? Okay, back. You know, while we're on our way to Mixala, or wherever I decide ending up going first, I want to talk to you guys a little. So, what to talk about? I guess this is actually... As you might know, the way my life goes, I record at home, then go to school for a couple weeks, maybe sneak over on the weekends to record some more, and... Oh, well, you know we're already at Sada. But I guess I can take this time to talk a little more. Anyways, this is, be this is actually being recorded the day before Thanksgiving. So, happy pre-Thanksgiving to everybody. Though this is probably going to be up quite a bit afterwards. That's... I don't know why. I just, that's something I really wanted to get off my chest. So I got it off my chest. Here in the town of Masada... There isn't really much to the town, it's just a good old farm place. Girl, we were just over there for a brief second. Um, so we're not here. Look across the ocean, you can see Tornada to the south. What does this girl have to say? The people in Girl prefer, they look kind of weird, kind of, but they're nice enough. Going deep in those sound, you better be ready for trouble. No way I leave town. If I get out lost in the world there. Yeah, well you're not heroes like we are. Bah Bop Bok. No, you might not have no this is only like happened once in the original Golden Sun, but you can mind reading animals and they have stuff to say. 
That chicken gave us a hint, whether you realize it or not. So, let's actually scoop around and see if we can find anything good. Uh, well, you know, ladders. <sighs> Pardon me. Any items in these? Nope. What about here? Nope. On this rock? Nope. Triple fail. I just... Not even really fail, but... Well, you know, we're on the other side of hay bale, which I don't get why we could just climb over or jump over. I guess it was respect towards property. I get it then. It's not always healthy to apply logic to Nintendo games, but I try to do as much as I can without hurting my brain. And guess what? We got our second Marstogen! Jenna found the Marstogen spark. You know what that means! Get rid of the dang Mercury, and hello the Jin. Jenna actually is now the witch class. It's okay, she's still the good old Jenna we know and love. Don't be witches. Don't have seg- Don't show your segregation, racist, or whatever you call it towards witches just because Jenna's one now. She's still as cool as ever. She doesn't do the- Stupid wicked stuff. It's just a title. And by stupid, I mean like stupid to hate, stupid to assume just because you're called a witch that you do the sort of things they do. Eh, it's not some. That's not really a topic I really want to get too into. If you don't know what it is, just Google witchin or witches. You probably know what witches are. Wiccan's kind of like, it's the closest thing I can see in regular society to witches, but enough topic, enough talking about witches. We only have a small shop here. I used to specialize in idols, but now I sell weapons and armors. <laughs> yeah, I also go really worry about questions. Ooh, this is a cool new item, and it can be given to Jenna or Shabia. Default answer is give the best stuff to Jenna, but it doesn't really give her that much of an attack boost. Should be on the other hand, she could probably. What's this side? Silonian seal. That would be pretty good, actually. So let's equip it to her. And sure, let's sell the magic rod. I don't think we'll be using it anymore. Speaking of which, let's see if we can sell anything else. And no, the One Piece dress is staying with us. Shopping spree cut! Alright, I'm back. Uh, let's take a quick look at all the stuff we got. Equipment was... Oh yeah, our... Uh, we just got an armlet for Jenna. Nothing else really changed about her. Felix, we got... Him, the Synergy armor. And the bronze helm. If I recall right, the synergy armor boosts his synergy. Which might make it more useful for him to have a trainer's whip. Once we can actually. I don't know. To upgrade his class, we actually need to give one of our Marcigens to Felix. And I'm not so comfortable with that quite yet. Because that requires giving Jenna something besides the Marcigen. Oh, yeah, it should be as. I got her that bless ink, as you saw. I think. No, and she just got an armlet. Nothing too different about her. So, hmm, I think it's not quite time to end the part. It's close. You know, there's actually something I want to do up here. Was it? There's a cave around here. And that's where we can get a new summon. Not to be quite smart. Wow. All that time, a void was up. Oh my. Wow. Actually, I think we'll save that. There's a little bit of... Nah. I'd rather get the puzzle out of the way and... 
it's not, see, it's not even much of a puzzle. It's just, you scoop here, climb down ladder, and make your way over to the other side. There's not even a labyrinth. What was I worried about not getting this done in 15 minutes? We're already at the summon. We can now summon Margarita. I probably horribly mispronounced that. One Mars and one Jupiter Digin are needed to pull that off. And I'll probably show that off in the next random battle we get. I would call it a part, but... I, I'm debating whether or not to get this Digin out of the way, too. If I get it out of the way now, we could probably just go right back to Grow in the next episode, so... Nah. Yeah, getting two Dijins in one episode isn't a bad thing. Only because I know you guys want to see it. Wait to see what happens after Jenna does Flare Wall. Rick and Rock! Yo! No comment about the damage, please. Just because they're a. <laughs> <laughs> of boldness. <laughs> wow! The game hates me and the children! I don't think that the djinn is there. Uh, let's try over here. There's our djinn! Just, um, so Spark actually allows us to revive an ally. It seems a bit early for a djinn like that, so more the merrier, I suppose. Just, I'm gonna call it a part after this, but it's not. We have to defeat the Djinn first. By the holy arrows of light, I summon V. Defeat the Djinn, and so we can move on with ease. Cool. I don't mean that was cool, but... I've never seen that Sire. We haven't seen that synergy in this video before. Or in this Let's Play, I mean. And by in this Let's Play, I even include the... Uh, first goal of Sun Gate. Because in some sense, Lost Age... I don't really consider Lost Age a sequel to Golden Sun as much as it's just a continuation. I guess technically it is a sequel, but from what I hear of how this, how Lost Ages and the original Golden Sun were originally going to be one whole game, and how the original just breaks off right in the middle, I, I personally consider the Lost Ages to be part of Golden Sun and not its own game. Not that it's a bad thing. Only thing that it prevents it from being a series, but Dark Dawn came out, so the game technically has two games, even if you were to consider Golden Sun and the Lost Ages to be one game. So it's, so it's able to qualify for Smash Bros. Brawl material. <laughs> That's the whole point of it being a series. But with that bias towards Golden Sun out of the way, Felix is floating on trees. But more importantly, we found the Djinn Sour. That Jenna got. Oh, the Djinns just love Jenna today. Unfortunately, Jenna does not accept their love back. So, that's actually the three things I really wanted to get done, and why I didn't just go to Maran from Yampei Desert. The Mars Dijin, the Summon, and that Mercury Dijin. So, in between parts, I'll double check to make sure I'm not forgetting anything between Masala and Garalg. And if not, I'll just meet you over by the town, because you saw how I got over here. I'll even take you back over to Masala. So, if you do forget how to get there, you can just follow me going from that town to to this town. Um, I said this town. Yep. And just go backwards from what I did to go back to Garel, if you can't figure it out. The game is pretty generous and gives you a path pretty much back to it if... But you can always refer back to the video if you forget. Anyways, this has been Jackie K, bringing you more Golden Sun, The Lost Ages. And I'll see you all guys back at Garo. Bye.